Hey, Riverwood Church. You know, we've been talking a lot about living in the vine, being one of the branches, getting our life from Jesus. And the fruit of that abiding in Christ is love. And that is the greatest commandment. That is a commandment that Jesus left with his disciples to do is to love. And, and we talked a little bit about, you know, loving our enemies and, and how challenging that is and that that's something that we have to give our, of ourselves to do so. But I was reading in Luke chapter six this morning and I ran across this verse I wanna share with you. Jesus said, but love your enemies and do good and lend expecting nothing in return and your reward will be great and you will be sons of the most high get this now. He says, for he is kind to the ungrateful and to the evil. Be merciful as your father is merciful. Now that hit me. If there isn't anything that better defines our age right now, we, have, we are surrounded by ungrateful people and those that may seek to inflict pain upon us. And if we're truthful, but we find, I mean, if I'm truthful, I find that I, I'm also less grateful than I ought to be. And I need that mercy myself. So if we want to practice this thing of love, if we want to get better at it, let's go to the test. Do we love those who are ungrateful to us? Do we love those who might be painful for us? Do we give mercy to those? That's the challenge. I'm looking forward to uh, diving in even more in John chapter 16 this week. So read ahead with me and uh, look forward to seeing you Sunday as we dive into that uh, section of scripture. It'll be a good time. See you then.